lots and lots of them. that he could have applied with. Let's see where we're going first. Ace of Cups, creativity, love. Okay. Queen of Cups crossing over. Okay, in reverse. Wheel of Fortune, he looked out with it. And the Four of Cups underneath. He's having to be receptive to it. The the visa, he got lucky. He got very lucky, I feel, with how things have transpired. The Queen of Cups crossing over, of course, a lot of the legacy re rests on his relationship with his now deceased mother, Diana. Cups underneath, he got really lucky. Now, there's a lot of cups here. A lot of cups. Oh, and that's all the drama that happens after it. We have got the King of Swords leaving the situation. I feel like this is going to be a wild ride. Okay, I'm going to tell you what I see in these cards. He approached a politician around the time of him leaving the UK. That could well be at the time British politician was Boris Johnson, who is an air sign and king of swords. And I feel like he was rebuffed somehow with this. We have got the cups here. Now, cups are all about emotions and creativity. I asked in my head while I was doing it, I want a clear sign of what all of this is. We've got a lot of cups here. Things haven't went as well, as well as they would have done. I feel like he has got in on a kind of like an artist visa, like a performer's visa, somebody with exceptional talent. I feel like with all the cups, that's what it is. I don't think it's a political visa. The hanged man here, yeah, that could be him waiting and everybody waiting to have some tea revealed about his visa. Knight of Pentacles is what's surrounding the situation. Yeah, everyone wants to know, how did that boy get into the United States? That man, the Three of Cups in reverse, he's not very happy about how he's entered, if you know what I mean. The Ace of Swords. Ooh. He didn't get diplomatic. He really didn't get diplomatic. And that Queen of Swords in reverse. Mm -mm. He is not there by a diplomatic visa by any stretch of the imagination. We have got the sword surrounding it. I feel like somebody, Queen of Swords energy is in reverse. There is an influence on the outcome of the current visa coming from a Queen of Swords energy. Now, that Queen of Swords, it could be a politician or it could be, to be more specific, it could be somebody associated with politics who's a Gemini, a Libra or an Aquarian. Uh, they're going to try and cover some tracks for him. But I feel like he has tried to get like a diplomatic visa. And that hasn't happened. Because he feels like he's landed on his feet when we come to the Ace of Cups. Like all of a sudden he feels like, oh, actually, I'm really creative. I've got a D and GCSE art. The Four of Cups is in reverse underneath. So he was kind of receptive to this idea. The Queen of Cups crossing over in reverse. Yes, he is the son of a very famous influential lady. I I'm, I don't see I don't see any I see politicians but I don't see them directly involved in the visa. The direct involved in the visa is some type of creative visa. I know I don't understand it either, but all the cups, emotions, creativity. If it was going to be, 
if it was a diplomatic visa, I would have expected something like the Ace of Swords instead of the Ace of Cups to be there. The Ace of Swords is in reverse. He still would like a diplomatic visa. He's still gunning for that kind of recognition and that kind of clout, but I don't see him on anything other than a creative a creative um mm. no that is definitely creative can you see what i mean when i'm coming into this energy you've got the queen of swords in reverse the king of swords i feel like i'm being perfectly honest i feel like that's boris johnson and he's tried to say to Boris way back in 2020, can you sort my visa out or something? And Boris is kind of went, <laughs> and kind of like shrugged it off. The Wheel of Fortune, he got lucky here. His, his tail is very lucky. They just got in before lockdown. They just managed to scrape on in. But you had a lot of people, I feel, for him, who are like, put it down as creativity, creative visa. The three of cups in reverse, that is all of the hubris, all of the gossip, all of the chatter, that what his visa is about. And the queen of swords in reverse, I suggest they're going to try and cover something up with either a politician or a legal person, a lawyer, and they're going to be female. They're going to try and cover something up here. So, yeah, I do see him, to be honest, that's what the cards are showing. It's the creative. It is creative. Rather than representing a business, if you will. Yeah, Boris, Boris was a... Um, um, he had dual citizenship right up to the point he went for prime minister. The only thing creative about Harry is the people who fill in all the hair follicles <laughs> on the Photoshop. It's like, not only does his hair grow fuller, but it also grows a dark shade of ginger as well. Have you noticed that? Does he have an A1 visa? Oh, he has like a creative visa. He doesn't have a he doesn't have a diplomatic visa. From what I can see with the cards. He could have went with a spousal visa, but I feel like he's on a creative, he's like on some type of creative or very famous person visa. Not that I know a lot about visas. But it's not diplomatic, not according to the cards anyway. Because the reason I'm saying it's not diplomatic is because of all of the cups. What type of visa is it on? All of the cups. <laughs> and the King of Swords wasn't in the centre of the spread. It was off. So he had tried the diplomatic way, but he got told no. Hello, Iris Love. The thing is with diplomatic visas, though, we would have found out because there's lists of diplomatic visas. Do I think he's had a hair transplant? No, apparently he's taking tablets for his hair. Do you want me to look into that? <laughs> An important person, yeah. They are like, there is a visa... Oh, where it's not diplomatic. It is like very famous, influential people. So it's nothing to do with the state. So it would, I imagine like, like Piers Morgan could go across there on that. Or um, James Corden was probably over with you guys in America with that. Um People like David Beckham will have that. Um, people like 
uh, da, 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 I'm trying to think off the top of my head. I think Adele is got citizenship, American citizenship now, but she would have went over there initially on this kind of creative, important, world famous, influential person visa. But it's not the same as diplomatic because you've got to remember a lot of dipl diplomats aren't world famous. Hmm. According to Crazy Days and Nights, he's taking hair tablets. Do you want me to look into that? <laughs> I can do. I don't mind keeping it light. Maybe spray on colour. You can get those like fake hair sprays, can't you? And it like, do you know the ones that do your roots? And you can get like like to cover your gray <laughs> it's like these like spray things you get them in the chemist you get them in the 